Here at the Princeton University store, they say sales are actually up since the women have gotten into the tournament. Kiani Brown works at the university store's Nassau Street location. She says alumni have flooded in since the Lady Tigers found out last weekend they made the tournament. It's really lively. It's very fun to hear all the alumni come over, especially with our cell. They tend to come to the store a lot. It's not just alumni who have Princeton pride. It's also students. Super hype. I think that everyone's extra excited. Kendall Zhang is extra excited because her friend Parker Hill plays for the team. Super excited. Um, great continuation from last year. I'm really excited to see her play um, in the upcoming games. For the fifth straight time, the Tigers are Ivy Madness champions. The ninth-ranked Lady Tigers also have a huge fan base among their fellow student athletes. It's awesome. Uh, super cool to have um, a women's team, you know, making the tournament this year. Jake Bolt plays for Princeton's baseball team, and he and his teammates attended several women's basketball games. And it's super important. Uh, we're not the biggest school, so. Uh, to get people at our games, it's super important to have friends on other teams come and support. So it's just great to build the community, and, and that's the special thing about Princeton. Brown and their co-worker Jasmine De Leon hope the Lady Tigers will dispel what they say are some misnomers about Princeton. We're not only smart, but athletic too. <laughs> Princeton isn't as intimidating as it seems like, you know, but it's really nice. Everyone's nice. While polite off the court, students and alumni hope the Lady Tigers will be as feared on the court as their mascot when they play West Virginia later this week. Brandon Goldner, CBS News, Philadelphia.